Hi everyone. everyone! This month in news, the Charlatan investigates. Are smoking zones being enforced on campus? Drew May has that story. How does the plant wall work and how much does it cost? Marina von Stackelberg has that story. And who uses the residences during the summer and how much profit does Carlton make off of it? Amy Thatcher investigates. And we have all the details on the infamous tunnel motorcycle video. Fraser Tripp has that story. And that's this month in news. Hi guys, I'm Kirsten, filling in as national editor this month. This issue, Erica Howes tells us about a college in the States that's adding League of Legends to its list of varsity sports. And Kathleen Charlebois updates us on the U of O hockey situation. The CIS has announced the players will be allowed to switch teams. And that's this month in National. Hi, my name's Amy Yi, and this month I've been filling in for Features Editor Christine Lee. This month we checked out summer camps. We look at the benefits of going to them for both elementary and university students. Our reporter Max Zeke gets all the info on that, so be sure to check it out. Hi everyone, this month in op-ed, Arif Jaffer debunks the fraternity myth saying that they're not the party clubs that you think they are. We also have a response letter by Brian Uden responding to Julia Allen's gender technology piece. There's also a ton of blogs online. That's this month in op-ed. This month in arts, Callum Slingerland gives us the skinny on the breakout acts of Blues Fest 2014, and Brittany Gushu attends Asinabka, an indigenous arts festival based in Ottawa. And that's this month in arts. This month in sports, we're taking a look at the newly renovated and new inductees into the Ravens Hall of Fame, as well as 40th anniversary of the Carl and the Ravens Sports Camp. That's this month in sports. Hey guys, this week in multimedia, Shamatu Shakiran finds out what Carleton students think about smoking on campus. And Sam Godding joins us to explain just exactly what League of Legends is all about. And that's this month in the Charlatan.